What are you doing, Twitch? This is where I really wish I knew better sign language. Hello, can you hear me? It is Aki, your friend Aki. Cool. That's, that's good. I can that's hear good. Aki. Yeah. I can, I can hear uh, Eric. I can hear me. I can me. hear yep. myself. <laughs> yeah, I can't hear Steven. Yeah. Oh, weird. That's so odd. That's right. so weird. Yeah. Nope. On the stream, I can't hear, but we can hear you here. Yeah. I'll be back. Some technical difficulties currently taking place on the channel right now, folks, but we're going to sort it out for you ASAP. I mean, at the very least, they could read his captions. Still yeah, there. and and just to just to kind of reiterate what Stephen was saying before you left, Happy New Year, everybody. We're back. Yay. Hope you had a good, safe holiday. Hope you're all taking care of yourself. How are you guys doing? Have you been taking care of yourselves? Not in the slightest. <laughs> well, that's a very typical Eric answer. It's... Hello, hello. Can't hear you on stream. That's so weird. All right, we will continue to entertain the crowds. Oh, cool. Thanks. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Ba -da 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 oh, yeah. Oh, thank you for taking that like, three <laughs> doctor side. I say that not. He's I've always been, been able to. to do that. <laughs> I can't do it right. perfectly, but I can do it a little bit. <laughs> I cannot. I've I've never been able Someone to. Someone do doesn't whistle watch tones. TV on TikTok. Wow. But yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. That, Does that anyone was... respond to messages on TikTok though? Good, good point. You can send messages on TikTok. I don't <laughs> even have yeah. TikTok, so. Wow. I that just is probably the, the most feed. boomer thing I've ever said, and I apologize, but you know. I don't, I, well, this is the thing. It's like, <laughs> I didn't do Snapchat when there was Snapchat, and I didn't do uh, Vine when there was Vine. Like, I don't, weirdly enough, for somebody who spends a lot of time on camera, I don't actually like to be on camera. I don't know if that makes sense. Well, you can just pass. I mean, I'm I'm on TikTok all the time, but I don't post. I, you know, it, 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 what I, I watch I, TikToks yeah, when they show up. Like, yeah, but I don't it's have great because unlike app. snapchat you had to like follow people and stuff like that tiktok they're just like i don't know you like these things here you go <laughs> i just don't have the app i guess is, it is that that means That's to valid. say uh but yes uh, in order to, to help uh move things semi along i guess i will take over steven's job here for a moment <laughs> since i've actually done it before hi yeah, everybody Cool. Yep. Uh, so everybody, just so that you know, we have a couple of goals. Uh, we try to raise about 250 per episode. So make sure that you uh, make some donations. The best way to, to show your appreciation and love for us, we have announcements uh, that you can spend $15 in, in order to do like toasts, but they're usually announcements made by our lovely, lovely uh, Secretary Gladys, whom we love and adore. We, we hope she's doing well and had a great had a great, you know. What's uh, the estimate on the packs of cigarettes she's smoked since last time we saw her? Yeah, I really the over under on that. I don't know. <laughs> I have I'm zero really, clue. <laughs> I'm really curious to see what her voice has evolved to, and I hope you know that she's still, you know, having good time. And like when she's not at work, you know, that our dating life is as healthy as as it's been in the past. Like you know, mm -hmm, wishing good things for Gladys. I guess we're gonna see. I guess we're gonna see uh, how she's doing when we'll we uh, get our see. first. Yeah. yeah, but we but... can't. We can't find out until y'all, you know, 
buy up some toasts. I'm just saying, like grab those toasts because they're a great, a great opportunity for you to tell us what you're thinking. <laughs> 24 <laughs> points. 29 to 4. 29. She, tried, she tried the patch during Christmas. Aw, bless yeah. you guys. We, we appreciate you. She tried her uh, best. Uh, did, who wants to take the next one? I got it. Uh, we want to thank our uh, uh, season sponsor, Hero Forge, uh, for supporting us in the things that we do. Uh, we all have, for the most part, created uh, Hero Forge versions of ourselves, and they'll be showing at some point. Uh, if you type exclamation point Hero Forge in the chat, you can check it out. Uh, they have a wonderful custom customization tool um to create your perfect little miniature and it's getting very specific and it's so they cool. have added so <clears throat> many cool features and they're like i know that one of the features they're planning to add if they haven't added already is they're going to add kit bashing to euro forge which is just freaking wild like it's so dang good it's so I'm, good i'm literally building dolly right now and i'm overwhelmed because there's so many things to pick there are a lot of choices i'm gonna have to look at building um uh manny after this because if i try to do it now well i will get sucked in and you guys will get, get nothing of value out of me for the rest of the stream unless you know we just want to make the rest like if in the event that we can't get steven sound back this 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 episode could just be us building our miniatures for stream i don't it's know true. it's true uh we also uh have an amazing partnership with Die Hard Dice. Uh you can save 10% at Die Hard Dice using the code Saving Throw 22. That is S A V I N G T H R O W 22. Uh uh use the command D H D in the checkout uh to get a different chat different wow use it in the <laughs> chat in the chat <laughs> wow i'm struggling use estimation dhd in the chat below for different links and all those things uh you can get many people's dice including mine if they're back but i don't think they're back yet so i'm not going to talk about it uh and uh said, for, just just, so you know he does have dice and when they're back in stock you should absolutely buy them and i don't know they're what called crescendo is. right no, they are called Forte. Forte, that's what it is. Is Crescendo mm -hmm. uh, Kelly's dice? I think Crescendo is Kelly's dice, yeah, yes. Yeah. Um, but yeah, also, I guess uh, uh, a good friend of us, uh, Vanna, uh, she also, they also have uh, some dice with them as well. So check out Die Hard Dice uh, today. Uh, throwing it back to whoever wants it. Hmm. All right. Well, if you're watching us on YouTube, um, thank you so much. <laughs> there is so much you. happening outside yeah. my house right now. I'm so yeah. sorry. We appreciate you so much uh, for, for watching us on VOD. Make sure you hit like, subscribe, uh, ring the bell, all that good stuff so that you can be updated anytime we upload things to our YouTube channel. You rock. We appreciate you. Yay. Hi. Slowly but surely, we're making our way there. Yes. Lastly, you can support the channel through tips and monthly subscriptions via coffee. Is it coffee or Ko-Fi? Because I've always I say coffee. 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 Um, you can enter exclamation point coffee in the chat to check it out. On coffee, you can also tip as you would regularly, and you can join the Exploration Society uh, with a monthly amount, which is really cool. Coffee has entered a lot of like new things recently, so you can support your creators monthly instead of like going back every month to tip, which is wonderful. Um, you get the same rewards as you would on Patreon, and you can unlock things like toasts with your tips. Plus, coffee doesn't take a cut, and that is wonderful. So nearly 100% of the tip goes straight to the channel after PayPal, but that is inevitable. So um, if you consider doing coffee, you've done coffee in the past for us. Thank you. We really appreciate it. Any support for the channel is wonderful. Also, I think we're about to find out how Gladys is doing right now because we have a toast from Five Foot Latina. What? Yes, if you look at the chat, Eric, in here in the in the oh okay. Uh, let me normally I wait for those to pop up. So now I got to. I had it already. I was gonna do it. Let me. You're uh, good, my friend. Where? It's three up. Three up. I don't, I can't read. It's here. It's here. It's in the. It's in the. It's in the video ninja chat. Okay. Thank you. All oh, right. Thanks, Mika. <laughs> Mika did the thing that would have actually helped that I didn't do. So. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So it looks like uh, another toast has arrived. Uh, assuming this man, that button doesn't work. Great. So that button doesn't <laughs> have to work. <laughs> sometimes that button doesn't, doesn't work. So sometimes. Uh, good, good afternoon, kids. Uh, we, we, try to, we try to cut back, but it's just been... It's been <laughs> It's so hot lately. Uh, 
Uh, this uh, toast is from Five Foot Latina. It says, hey, kids, it's good to have you back. Uh, now try not to cause quite as much property damage this year, okay? Listen, you know, we only got so much, you know, you know funding, you know, the government gets mad when we do stuff. Uh, it's, it's hard, you know. Just, 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 you know, think what would Gladys do? Probably not blow up the gym again. I probably wouldn't do that. Anyway, that's Gladys. I want to sign off everything like that. Anyway, that's me. That's- <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Anyway, that's Gla- what would Gladys do? Oh, no. What would yeah. Gladys do? New shirt. Oh, goodness. Imagine we had a whole season where we made decisions based on Gladys. Ah. Speaking of shirts, you can get a t shirt with the new Pantheon Academia logo on it. It's a beautiful shirt, and you absolutely should buy one so that you can rep for your favorite fictional academy. It's true. Yeah. Who, uh, what other academies out there are we in competition with? I mean, nobody, anybody else cares about that part. <laughs> the only right. one that matters. That's what's up. All right. How's it happening? Um, how long has it been since we last saw our little children, our little, our little kids? Not much. No, we can't. I think Steven says about five months. Yeah. yeah, we can hear you just fine. Wait, we Actually, can't hear you we now. can't hear you now. Something happened. What happened with here. you, Steven? We can't, we hear, can't you hear you at all. <laughs> no. Oh. Suddenly everything went away. You might want to clear cookies and cash in your browser and then come back in. Huh? Oh, something came through. Yeah, that was like... Oh, oh. there we go. Yeah, we can hear that. <laughs> We can hear you. Yeah. Oh, I mean, I don't know if it's going through me, to the stream. Let me check but, stream. Let me check stream. Yeah, I don't know if it's coming through the stream, but it's coming through to us now at least. You're not on stream. Oh, no. Not right. the in-ear headphones. Oh, no. Well, it might. Be, before we jump to that conclusion, it might that might not be the problem. Like, we just do, you know, like, clear the clash and stuff and just yeah. do another in and out. Because like, you sounded yeah, fine. Bad. Yeah. And we and just make sure that like you have the correct microphone and all that stuff, you know, chosen and all this stuff. I'm not saying that you don't. I'm just saying that. Yeah. No, you're good, friend. Technical difficulties are not ever, ever the fault of the person. Always, always the fault of the technology. But uh, so like, <laughs> maybe not cash. with that phrasing. Steven, close the tab and then go and clear your cash and your cookies on your browser and then come back in. See you soon. While this is happening, <laughs> we could take this time <clears throat> to uh, if- t- talk about, I mean, not necessarily what we've done, but for any new ca- any new folk in chat, explain who our characters are and, what, and what's going on. Yeah, yeah oh, wow. we could do that. Who mm-hmm. wants to start? We should all roll a D4, a D20. D20, D20 and, and whoever is the highest gets to oh. go first or whatever. I rolled a D20. Oh, man. Okay. Oof. I got a, I got a, I got a, a 19. So, oh, I, so Manny's going first. I, can't first. <laughs> I, think, I think that's what that means. I think that's what that means. Well, you weren't literally just the one to say whoever gets the highest goes first. So, I, I mean, <laughs> and then I fucking rolled a 19. So, fuck me, I guess. Hi, everybody. I'm Aki. I play Manny, who I believe, depending on when we're starting things uh, in this episode, may now be a junior. I don't know where we're starting. I don't know. I don't know if we're starting at the beginning of a new school year or not. But in any case, is currently a sophomore, perhaps a junior, and uh, they are uh, kind of the like. Well, they're they they're the uh, the manager for like the school pep squad, and their deity is Maat, the Egyptian goddess of truth, justice, and harmony. Uh, and at level four, they now have two abilities. One of them is the re- the revelation of truth, uh, and the second, the dispensation of justice. So uh, we're it'll be pretty interesting to see like when they get that third ability what harmony is going to look like because dispensation of justice oh, is pretty gnarly. I just yeah, yeah 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 it's the revelation of truth dispensation of justice. I think it's probably going to be called something like return to harmony. Um, what do these abilities do? 
Uh, so the revelation of a truth is anything within like a certain range of me is compelled to reveal its secrets and our true intent. And then dispensation of justice is uh, one of uh, Ma'at's kind of darker abilities is that she is a kind of sort of a goddess of death in that she like, it's interesting. You should read about Ma'at. She's mm -hmm. she's got like a f interesting the like, scales, the, the, the feather, of, and the heart. Yeah, yeah. Like, ex like interesting lexicon of like abilities and like symbolism involved with her. But basically, the second one sucks all of the air out of the room and makes it difficult to breathe. So, kind of like certain people when they walk into a space. But yeah, so those are the two abilities they have. And like, so let's see, what, what's Manny been up to? Manny has been discovering things about themselves. I think they kind of figured out last season after some conversation, watching their friends kind of go through some different things that they are uh, an arrow ace uh, individual um, and kind of figuring out what that means to them. And as a general rule, they are a notorious enabler and they like to kind of... Uh, cheer their friends on even if they're not making the wisest decisions um always doing fun ridiculous things that's manny all right who's next <laughs> do we want to give it. steven a chance to sort of test his stuff really fast to see uh, if it's it's fixed sure. hi steven well we can hear you no still no, no. sound on twitch that's so weird it's oh, not your fault, Stephen. It's not your fault. It is. It's not your fault. The over dramatics for me. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good. Hey. But I just want to reiterate to you, Stephen, that it's not your fault. Something <laughs> funky and weird is happening, but it is not you. Do you think we could, hey, uh, year and change. Dom, do you think we could possibly give him a fresh link? Do you think that would help? <laughs> Try oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What? What? We have what speak, speak, Stephen. Bark, bark. Timmy's in the well. <gasps> it worked. So what the fuck? You, you, yay! All you had to do was go into hysterics and 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 yeah. video ninja was like, okay, fine. You just had to be dramatic. <laughs> All right. Wow. I'm clutching my pearls over here. Well. It doesn't. It doesn't matter. One, because one, four twenty, blaze it. Two, uh, we have another toast, and three, there are other people here who who have to introduce their characters. Exactly. So we can do. We can do our character stuff still, and then we'll hand it Please. over to um, Steven. I believe it's Eric's turn because Eric rolled sixteen. Yes, it is my turn. Uh, hello, everyone. Uh, my name is Eric. I'm playing uh, Lennox Thatcher, uh, who who is. Uh, a rich former sports sports boy uh, who's got the, the goddess Dinkasa, the Sumerian goddess of beer living with inside of him. Uh, his, his, his main abilities are transforming himself into a liquid like Alex Mack uh, and uh, telepathy. <laughs> oh, yeah. Wow. You can read people's minds. Now. I forgot about that. Oh, yeah. Manny can, <laughs> can, can go through walls. They, they, can, they, can, they can go through walls and floors and stuff. I almost forgot about that. Did you get a secondary ability too? Other yeah. than the Loki ability. Yeah, the Loki that, ability yeah, the Loki with ability my is... telepathy. The the secondary ability is is like a calm emotions kind of thing. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's that's good. That's good. I tried to keep it all on theme, but it's hard because all Ninkasa does is uh make beer and bread and make people happy. <laughs> hey, those are important things. Beer and bread are great. Yes. It's true. Bread is that it? with beer, even better. That's, that's all I can think of. Uh, that's all I can think of. I want a focaccia. Uh, then I'm next. Uh, yeah, you know, I play Kawame, yo, yo, resident cool boy, uh, who is yet to be inducted into the school safety squad. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, he's a he's a uh, he's an, uh, a silver tongue for sure. 
uh, now the captain of the basketball team because his ability. Well, first of all, he's connected to uh, Anansi, the West African trickster god of stories, the spider West African trickster god of stories. Uh, and with that, with every story that he can spin, uh, Kawame's first ability is basically minor reality warping in a way. Uh, so as long as he writes that story or spins that story, it can happen. But the bigger the story, the bigger the consequences, uh, which we found out last uh, season. Uh, twice. Um, and yeah, his second Bidari ability, because you know he is a spider, uh, Kawame can turn into uh, any spider possible. Um, it's so great for me. I love this for me. <laughs> quite great, quite great. Uh, and his Loki ability made him very strong. He is now strong basketball boy. Uh, and yeah, you know, he's just going through because he is about to be a senior, probably. So we'll see how this looks. Uh, and yeah, also, uh, it, it's this, it's the uh, beginning of potentially Kwame and Lenny. So we're going to see what that looks like because we don't know because. Kwame is cool and charismatic but when it comes to his own love life. So, yeah, that's him. <laughs> should. Hold on, not you. You got one more. Thank God. <laughs> No, I talk. My I talked a lot. I talked a lot in the uh, in the effort to kill time. Um, I don't want to be dramatic, but Stephen, we can't hear you on stream anymore. <laughs> oh no. Um. Anyway, no, I'm not fucking with you. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Um, is there some weird connection with your mic right now, Steve? Yeah. Is it like? It, I don't think it's a. It's exactly a uh, hardware issue for him. No, I don't think so either. Because we can hear him perfect. It's not a you thing, Stephen. It isn't not. It's really not you. It's a <laughs> it's a video ninja thing right now. Mm. Which if we get yeah. on, we don't know what it is. I'm so sorry. Um, anyway, <laughs> my character is Dolly Wingrove. She's our lovable little theater kid, um, who whose heart is a little too open to everyone, constantly, at every moment of the day. She, her, her divinity is Persephone, and through Persephone, she has the abilities to talk to plants and summon them, um, as well as uh, she got Umbra Kinesis, which comes from Persephone's goddess of the underworld side, where she can control light and dark, um, which is pretty cool. And then her Loki power that she got is she can scream and break things. She's very loud. Which we haven't seen yet. No, she has not screamed yet. <laughs> I can't you wait. Think, you would I'm think so that excited. she would be projecting so the person in the back of the room can hear her without a mic, but she hasn't done that yet. <laughs> so, Also, I'm building her on Hero Forge right now, and I just found out you can put microphones in their hands. It's over. That's it. <laughs> yeah. Lenny had two two beer mugs. Oh, that's sure. Sure, that's good. Uh, yeah, and that's that's you little can Dahlia. Do... Yay, Dahlia, we love her. Now it's your turn, Stephen. Hello. Can they hear me? Does it matter? Is there anybody in there? Is there anyone out there? Why is my phone making noise? They can hear you. They can hear me. Yeah. Top. All right. Don't Hello, stop, everyone. Just keep talking. You can't Hello, stop everyone. talking. Hello, everyone. My name is Stephen. <laughs> I, I, I got to keep talking or this chat will explode. That's right. This stream is set to detonate if I go under 55 miles per hour or I stop talking. And streams can't move, so we're already in a bad spot. My name is Stephen Pope, and welcome to New Pantheon Academia, the anime-inspired role-playing game here on Saving Throw Show, powered by Overarms. If 
by Rookie Jet Studios, available now on Drive Through RPG. Um, <clears throat> last season, a lot happened. Clearly, I would throw it over to our players, but they already did that. Thank you all. I love you all terribly. I'm very sorry we're having technical difficulties on my end. But until they come back, we're going to try to keep this going. God help me. Gods help me. <sighs> so. Last season, the four of you fought the Scarecrows, effectively superpowered beings made by the door to oblivion, which has something in it that is very much alive and very much hates you. So, uh, you defeated the seven, seven Scarecrows, and then Darkness. And that's where we left off, and it's been a long time since then. So... We're going to start off with you, Kwame. Yeah. Great. Kwame, you were, your dad, uh, your dad ran for governor, right, of Oregon? Uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Wait, can you hear me? Yes. Um, sorry. Uh, no, I'm sorry. State representative. Uh, mm. And, and, you know. Things happened. Do I got to get into it? You got to make me relive the trauma? Oh, no. No, no, no. I have new trauma to give you all. Oh, yay. But, yeah. Um, so you, and if I'm not mistaken, Kwame is also a North Point, Oregon uh, local, right? Well, now he moved here uh, when he was uh, young, but mm -hmm. his parents didn't originally live here. Yeah. Right. His uh, family is... Uh, I, uh, they're from Senegal, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Kwame, you wake up to the sound of scratching, uh, someone furiously writing with a pencil. And when your eyes open, you are not in your dorm room. You're in your room at home. Okay. What's it uh... look like? Okay. Um, and I'm currently like me, not like yeah, you. A, okay. Um, You're Kwame Akinyemi. No, when you get you get thrown into the wolves and you okay. Um, yeah. No, he has a pretty nice home. Uh, it's not as nice as Lenny's is. Uh, as just far as that's just extra money for no reason. Like that's like, you know. To go there, but not to go there, that's like, you know, borderline plantation house money, you know, even though it's not plantation house at all, cover it nor up north. Uh, but, you know, that, that's that money. Uh, no, he, he just has a really nice, like, modern-esque uh, home, um, you know, big garage, uh, swimming pool, all that jazz. Uh, it's very, I don't know the exact terminology of, like, the architecture, um, but... Um, yeah, you know, there's lots of windows, like the glass windows everywhere. You know, that that type of vibe. Uh, he, uh, I mean, it's his his room is pretty, you know, simple. Big old bed, big old king size bed. Uh, he like has, uh, yeah. Uh, he uh, also is tall. Uh, like, I'm barely, I'm I'm, I'm in the queen, and I want a king. Anywho, um, uh, yeah, he has a desk. Uh, you know, where he does some of his work, some of his poetry stuff. Uh, he has like uh, a couple of awards, uh, hanging up and on the uh, on the uh, shelving that he has. Uh, the room is very much um, that uh, it's like a blue and brown ish color scheme. Um, is what he's going with. Uh, I mean, yeah, it's a room, it ain't nothing <laughs> super, super special. Fair. Uh, it doesn't have yeah. to be. <laughs> um, you awaken and you are in your king size bed, which as a 31 year old, I do not have and I'm not jealous of. Um, a Nazi is next to you. Uh, he is surrounded by papers with pencils in uh, three of his eight hands, furiously taking notes. Uh, he has a loosened tie around where. I guess his neck would be. And even though he doesn't have hair, he currently has a wig on that looks like it's a little frayed. Nope. That no, 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 no. From downstairs, you hear the sound of the clattering in your kitchen. Not like someone's in trouble, but like someone's cooking. 
And as soon as Anansi notices your eyes open, you do not move. Okay. All right. Stay. Stay. He gets up right onto your chest and like grabs your cheeks. No, we are not moving. Okay. Okay. Things are fine. Things are fine. This is fine. This is fine. Just got to figure this out. If I figure this out, we'll be fine. Fine. It's fine. Before I answer, am I aware that I'm like in a dream escape? Uh, is this like present? It feels present. Okay. Um, um, for lack of a better word, what the fuck is going on? I was just at school. Yes, I'm aware. We were at school and we fought that one guy. And then, you know, there was the ice cream and the, the bougie ice cream. And then we fought the guy. And then the football game. And then darkness. And now we're here. And I know. <laughs> what, are you, what are you writing right now? Um... It looks like he started writing a story and it just kept going and eventually he ran out of paper and it started on another page and not like, oh, I turned the page and kept writing. Like, it just keeps happening. Okay, are you trying to get a Nobel Peace Prize for the next most influential book or something? Like, what are you writing? What is, what, why can't I move out of my bed? Because, because there is this someone changed the story and I did not approve okay I did not approve this okay they did not file the paperwork they did not call they did not write they did not sedate facts but the story has been changed and I don't like that so uh, why isn't this working hold, hold on hold on hold on hold on wait I just really want to stretch what Will me getting out of my bed change the story even more? No. Then I'm going to get out of my bed for two seconds. Fine. And I roll out of my bed. Hand me uh, that sticky note while you're up. It's um. Wait. And I'm going to get up and stretch because I was laying in bed. Um. And I'm going to look for a sticky note that he's speaking of. Um, yeah, he's just pointing to uh, a stack of sticky notes on your bed. Yeah. Oh, oh, then yeah, yeah. I literally just take it and just toss it to him. Um, so you are the best storyteller, but you are not the <laughs> only the storyteller. That's my job. That's, that's my okay, job. okay. But we know there are other people who can write stories and do things like this. So have you talked to the others? Did Mrs. Uh, Doctor Doctor? I must say Doctor Wu and Doctor Yang. Both Dr. of those were wrong. Dr. Wang, I was close, but different. Um, Dr. Wang has, um, oh, whoever she's connected to, she kind of does the same thing. Did you talk to that god? Did you talk to, I don't know, um, Prometheus? He, he wrote the story of fire, and it happened. Like, Did you talk to like others, or are you just freaking out for the sake of being a drama king? Yes, you're a drama king. Try out for the musical. Uh, he's ran out of sticky notes, and the writing has actually moved onto your bed sheets. Stop writing on my those are. Mm. Oh, they're from Target. Don't be dramatic. They are from IKEA. There's a difference. Yes, IKEA is cheaper. I. From downstairs, you hear uh, the voice of your dad. Actually, hey, you awake? If I say no, what would you say? Get your ass up. Breakfast will get cold soon. How long have I been here? Don't know. He throws the sticky notes into the air, but as they are sticky notes, most of them just kind of stick to him. So it's more just like, poof. Hold on. I'm going to grab my handy dandy phone and text Manny. And that text is going to say, hey, dot, 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 um, dot, dot, dot. The fuck is going on, question mark? Manny. Manny, you awake in your dorm room. It's how you left it. Nothing out of the ordinary. Um, and there is a knock at your door. Hello? Yeah? 
Uh, hello, Manny. It's uh, me, Le Leila. Leila, Leila. Leila Saeed, the school president. Oh, shoot. Um, Manny kicks the sheets off of them. And they're like, you know, in shorts and a t-shirt and they kind of pad over to the to the door and kind of open it. And, yeah? What, how, how can I help you? Uh, she's holding two coffees and she kind of holds one out to her. Did a little oh. crack in the door. I uh, brought you coffee. I figured we could uh, talk and walk on our way to homebrew. What time is it? Um, she tries to check her watch, but it's a little hard holding coffee. It's, uh, I believe we have about 15 minutes until homeroom. Um, I'm definitely not ready for homeroom. I just woke up. You woke me up. Oh, sorry. Did you miss your alarm? Um, it's so weird. What day is it? Monday. The, the date. What, what's the date? Oh, um, uh, February, I believe. Does that track with what I remember? No, it was autumn. February, holy shit. Um, I, I need a little bit of time to get ready for class. Um, they kind of stick their hand through and they take the coffee. Thank, thank, thank you so much for the coffee, Layla. Um, uh, please go ahead without me. Um, I, I might be a few minutes late for homeroom. Um, thanks okay. for the coffee. Uh, don't, don't forget our meeting later. Thank you. A meeting? Okay. Yeah. Meeting about what? Uh, she's already walking away. Uh, she, she knows when someone needs space. Um, when you sip your coffee, it is your exact order. Oh, how does she know my order? Why am I friends with the school president? Um, and like, uh, Manny kind of opens their door and kind of pokes her head down to see if Layla is like far enough away or gone or whatever. Uh, and she's as soon as just like, at the, she's at the elevator. Yeah. Like once she like in goes into the elevator, like Manny will duck out of their room and like, like fast walk down the hall and like knock on Lenny's door. Uh, there's no one in that room. Huh. Lenny, you awaken in a room it's like your dorm room, but homey. Like someone, like it's a dorm room because you always make your dorm room your own, but someone has taken the extra care and has obviously let you use, you know, uh, hammer and nails to actually put shit up because you're not gonna be taking this stuff down anytime soon. And you hear the sound of whistling and something being fried from um, a room from nearby. Even sorry, so sorry to interrupt. I actually meant to, meant to mention this earlier, but um, we have another toast in the chat. But, oh, hey! Yeah. Um, and it's, Lenny, it's... as you wake up, we have a toast. <laughs> Good morning, students. We got more announcements. Uh, we got... Uh, we got a toast from a uh, DJ regular. It says, uh, toast for New Pantheon. Uh, welcome back to North Point Academy. God, kids. Uh, hope you survive the experience. Uh, you know, that's the thing about life. Nobody gets out alive. That's what Gladys always says. All right, that's all. Yes. Um, Lenny, as Gladys drops a weird truth bomb, um, you notice it sounds really far away. Like, you can still hear it, but, you know, it's like you're off campus and someone made a school announcement, as opposed to when you're in your dorm and the speakers are, you know, out of the quad. Huh. Uh, what does the room look? So he looks around the room. Uh, are, are there, like, personal effects around? Yeah, there are. There are. Uh, there's a photo of you and your mom. There's uh, actual stuff from your childhood in here that you definitely oh. would not take the, you know, live at the university. Um, yeah, this is very homey. And it's definitely your room. <laughs> it just is not your room. Huh. That's like a strange. Uh, I'm going to go find out what that, that whistling's about. <laughs> All right. As you walk down the hallway, you're greeted with a man who, he looks a lot like you, 
but definitely takes after your dad more than you. His face is kind of scarred, but not in a way that's unattractive. And in a hand, he well, one of his hands is missing, and he has a prosthetic, and he is currently frying some eggs. And he looks over his shoulder. Oh, uh, hey, bro. Um, like, um, I don't know how to like approach this subject or whatever. Uh, yeah. And like, you know, I was in football for a while uh, uh -huh. and, and head trauma is like not like uncommon or whatever. Um, oh, yeah. No, head trauma like really is like. Yeah, it's it's, it's honestly like like kids playing football is probably not the best thing in the world. Um, oh, no. Yeah. Uh, but like last thing I remember, I was like with my friends and like we were like doing stuff um, and uh, I didn't live here and you were like. um like dead or whatever so it's like it's like like i'm gonna be honest it's like heck of confusing for me right now and i'm like not sure what's up uh he takes the uh egg white omelet he you know made from he made both you egg white omelets and they're you know about yay big he puts them up fable and he puts his uh actual hand on the back the back of his actual hand on your forehead. Uh, bro, are you like, uh, feeling okay? Did you, um, are you having bad dreams again? Um, I don't think so. I honestly, it's like all a blank. Uh, what time is it? Uh, it's like 7.30. Did I skip both my workouts? Yeah. You like really slept hard. Wow. I'm gonna be honest, like this, like it's like cool that you're like not dead or whatever, but like I'm gonna yeah. need like like some like some like info on that. Like like I don't know. Cause you've been like, I don't know, gone for like like ten years or whatever, you've been dead. So uh, like that's <laughs> it's like honestly, like I'm like this close to like having a complete breakdown right now, so like That'd be great. Like, uh, 10 years ago, I had that, like, really bad car accident. Mm hmm Lost this. Got, like, this. That's weird, because, like, I remember you dying and then, like, uh, dad not loving me anymore, uh, because cause you died instead of me, and then, like, everything falling apart, and then, like, me not being a real person till like, like, pretty recent. Like, whoa. Yeah. So it's like, like, honestly, I don't know if I'm like in like another dimension or if this is like a dream, that's like, that's like dope. But like, it's still weird. I'm going to, you know, I'm going to text my friends <laughs> and he just texts like group chain. He's like, uh, sup, sup y'all. Uh, it's Lenny. Um, I think I'm either like asleep right now or like in another dimension. So if you're like my friends from like my dimension, you could hit me back up. That'd be like hecka cool, cause like my brother's like not dead or whatever, and that's like strange. This is a voice memo too. <laughs> yeah. Um, Quint's just kind of standing there. He's a little concerned, and he they get actually... back to me pretty quick usually. Oh, cool, cool. Do Do you want me to write you a note? Like, do you need the day off? I'm a teacher. I can do that. I think. Oh, yeah. sick. You're a teacher? Yeah. yeah. Oh, where do you teach? North Point. Oh, like, that's N no way. I go to North Point. Yeah, bro. That, that's why you're my apartment, bro. Our apartment. Oh. Yeah, bro. Huh. Wow. Hold on one second. And he's just going to, like, uh, try and turn his hand into liquid? Um, You can. Okay. So that still works. Um, yeah. Uh, wow. I'll be honest. Like, I thought this was going to be a lot harder to get to this point. Um, what? Well, like, I was going to, like, I was, like, doing a lot of research on, like, how to how to go into dreams and, like, bring stuff back uh, oh. that's, like, real and whatever. Uh, I've been, like, working on that, like, super hard. Um, Sick. I guess I don't 
need to do that? Did I do this in my dream? I got to <laughs> He looks at his phone and <laughs> waits for someone. I got to like talk to somebody about this because this is like <laughs> wild. So, Dahlia, your yeah. phone's blowing the fuck up. As you sit in a meeting, um, as club president of the drama club, meeting with your academic advisor, Dr. Kim Winters, Kim Winters Ash, as she says. So she is in she's in her you know early thirties, late twenties. She's still cool. Uh, she has like the she has like the baby ride lesbian pride trans. She looks up and she just kind of blinks. She's blinking at you. I'm blinking back. Could you, could, could, could you do me a favor and stand up real quick, but I'll get like. Oh, um, yeah, my my outfit's pretty great today, right? Yes. Uh, Kim stands up, and she is significantly taller than you. Yeah, nice outfit, Dahlia. Wow, uh, you hit a second growth spurt there, Kim. Um, pu pu puberty too. <laughs> I remember the Obama administration now. That's new. Uh, right. Uh, yeah. Um, I'm very glad it's just you and me in here because I am freaking the fuck out. I mean, I I am too. Um, because it seems like I'm president of the drama club. Yeah. No. No. See. Apparently, not only are you president, I'm apparently in charge of your club now, and also I've paid taxes. Well, every citizen needs to pay taxes, but um, I couldn't drive twenty four hours ago. Yeah, it seems like something. I. I don't. Holy know. shit! I don't remember getting here. You know. Um, yeah, no, and you no, I, I, I usually don't the best part of getting no. to these places is remembering all the cheers and applause. Yeah, yeah, you know, um, there. I, 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 yes, I didn't die at some point. That's fine. Oh, right, yeah. And you're yeah. also not being mean to me right now, which is also kind I'm of. I'm not mean, okay? Uh, sometimes you are. I use it as. Whenever I need to get sad in a role, I think of the times that you've been mean to me. I'm going to be honest. Well, now I, instead of, like, wanting to be defensive about it, I actually just feel bad and I want to apologize. So double fuck this situation. I, I don't want to be mature. I haven't been, this is, this is bullshit. This is, hey, hey, this wait. is bullshit. Hello? You, wait, hold what on. Yelling at? What am I yelling at? The last time that anything not to this scale has happened, we have a friend who does stuff like this, Kim. That motherfucker. Yeah, someone else that's in the safety squad with us has the power to change things like this. Are you? Are you? Are you saying? Are I'm you saying, saying? I'm saying that Kwame knows that I wanted to be the captain of the drama club. Kwame knows that you would probably not would have had died. So no one wants, no one wants to die Kwame when they're also like fifteen knows and then come back. The I'm shorter than everyone else, so I don't know. I think this smells like a Kwame situation. If I'm being honest. Also, I feel like I'm obligated to say put your phone away, but at the same time, I don't want to do that. I'm not gonna put my phone away. Don't. Fuck! I'm supposed to say you are supposed to do that. I need I a drink. drink. Oh my god, I can drink. Oh no. Oh my god, I can drink. Please don't. That does not seem like a good mix with you. It's not even eight. I'm not gonna drink. Eight. Hold on. Wait. We're get. We're losing the plot here. Um. I think that we need to 
text the group. I think we need to... Kwame, obviously, he might have gotten drunk last night. Changed a lot of stuff. Said, hey, let's fix our friends' lives. Fine, fine. Let me just... I don't have him in my phone anymore. Hey, Kim, get off your phone. I have games on my... <laughs> I will suspend you. No, I can do that. I'm president. You can't. That's not how this works. <laughs> anyway, um, and I'm going to text Kwame. Uh, when you check your phone, you have a voice memo from Lenny, a text message from Kwame, and a text message from Manny. Oh. I'm going to listen to <laughs> Lenny's voice message and immediately get really concerned. Uh, hey, Lenny, president of the drama club here uh, with Kim Winters Ash, who is not dead. Um, some I wasn't dead before. Something's gone wrong. <sighs> you get a message back saying, um, I'm glad Kim's not dead. Also, congrats on being president. Thank you. Some people don't congratulate others. Where are we uh, all going to meet each other? Are we on a phone call now? <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> no, no, no. I send no, no. a voice message. God forbid you guys just get on a and, fucking phone yeah. call. You're sending voice memos to each other. Sending the voice memo. Where are we all going to meet? Um, Wait, oh, Kwame. Kwame, are you here? Kwame. No. <laughs> you come downstairs. Uh, your dad is currently burning the couscous and a thought of euphemism. Uh, to the dulcet tones of Lauren Hill's only album. Great. Unplugged doesn't count. Wow. Shade. It's true. Um, you know good and well you are not the cook of this house. Move. <sighs> he moves. Uh, your dad... He's a very handsome, dark-skinned man, kept in good shape, shaved head, bit of a goatee going on. Listen, sometimes you you want sometimes you want pasta for breakfast, and this this happens. All right. Yeah, then sometimes we know you burn the house down, and we don't want that this time. There's already a lot happening. As I look at my phone, constantly blowing up. Though I bing, do. Bing, yep. Bing. Yep. I look at all of it. I stare at the one that Lenny sends, and I keep going. Um, You're popular today. No. <laughs> um, I don't want to be popular right now. I'm going to cook this food, and then I'm going to go meet my friends, because I think things are necessary. I think I, I, I just can't stay long. Uh, you know, I mean, I, I leave early anyway. Um, nice. Sports I mean, stuff and all that. Sports stuff? Are you doing basketball? When I say sports, I mean... You hear screaming from upstairs from a Nazi. <sighs> I, I mean, um, no, not, I mean, like, you know, like, Sporty Spice. My friend likes the Spice Girls, and I... Oh, retro. Yeah, I know. Um, I mean, but what, what would be wrong with basketball if I did like it? Nothing. Just, uh, you know, with your, you know, poetry club and everything, I wasn't aware you had any interest, but... I support you. You know that. I'm just going to pause and mentally think about all the things that I am realizing that are changing right now. Uh, cool. Yeah, well, you've had a bit of a time. Ha, um, <clears throat> what, 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 what time is it? Not what time. What, like, what, what is today? Uh, February 3rd. February 3rd. Thank you, Siri. <laughs> I uh, keep telling your mom I don't understand this stupid watch. Uh, it's okay. I'll get you uh, something bad anyway. Uh, okay. It's February 3rd. N noted. Yeah, you all just get a lot of exclamation points uh, from me. Um, and I'll say, meet you all where? Question uh, mark. And I'll finish finish the couscous that he has obviously sort of destroyed. Your, and your dad cannot cook. Uh, this is what I get for trying to impress your mom. And that's when the back door opens. There's your mom, Kwame. She is back from a jog. She has her hair up in a ponytail. She has a sweatband on. 
she's doing that thing where you, you know, check your pulse. Ah. Had to get that out of my system. But that smells like burning. Did you? You're, you're trying to make apology breakfast, aren't you? I will neither confirm nor deny. <laughs> You're just going to see Kawame just stirring that couscous for a long time, and he is not turning around. Um, you feel a familiar hand uh, touch your lower back as she tries to peer over your shoulder, but you're very tall. Eh, he didn't do too bad of a job. Um. Mama? Yes, babe. Uh, um, I'm going to book it up the steps. Kwame. I don't turn around. Mm. I go into my room. I slam the door. I lock the door. What's going and on? Nancy looks up from the story, which has gone from the papers to your bed, to your floor, to your walls. He looks up at you. I don't know what's happening. And I have. He nods. Is 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 this a um? Is this this a uh, a like a another realm? Is this a uh, um, a nightmare? Is we've been in different spaces, and I'm just trying to make sure I it's can. It's not a new space. It's not a different space. This is a new story entirely that I had no hand in writing. There's a knock at your door. Kwame, what's wrong? And it's your mom. Concerned about you. Um, nothing. Uh, I, um, I just needed to, uh, fix my room. It, it was dirty and I didn't want you to see, um, it messed up. She kind of laughs at that. I just, I just, I'll, I'll be back downstairs in a second. All right. All right. You hear her muttering as she heads back downstairs. This is a group call. Um, so we all need to get together ASAP. Um, absolutely. Yeah. Uh, oh, <laughs> rough night, huh? I don't um, understand what's going on. All of this seems really weird. Lenny, why aren't you in your room? Um, I, I think I am in my room. It's like my brother owns an apartment or something or maybe we both do. i don't know it's confusing so your brother is back mm -hmm. you're the president of the of the of the drama club and kim is an adult who is yeah, your gonna... academic advisor and uh, i'm yeah. friends with the school president i don't know why and i'm supposed to be at a meeting later today she brought she brought me coffee and my mother's alive what I, I can't look at her. 
I'd rather look at you all right now, though. So where are you, and where can we meet up? Because I, 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 I uh, um, I'll just come to my room since apparently I'm the only one who lives on campus anymore. Uh, I'm just off campus because my brother's a teacher. Oh, I'm still on campus. I'm just in back-to-back -back meetings. You think you can Kim is them? over your sh is holding you by the shoulder, trying to listen in. You are not in meetings, for God's sake. I'm the president. Take me seriously. I am not going to take you seriously. Uh, anyway, I'll cancel my next three, and I can be over at your room, Manny. Yes. Sweet. I have snacks. <gasps> um, Lenny, can you um make something a little spicier? Like. Like those, uh, like, like Cheetos or what? Like alcohol. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. That's like mold wine? I don't know. Something that's just going to make me not feel uh, like I potentially just fucked something up, even though it probably wasn't my fault, but it could have been my fault. <laughs> I got the thing for that. Okay. Protein powder. Click. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I hope he's okay. Two dead relatives suddenly alive. It's weird. It's super weird. Is this a dream? Are we in a dream? I don't know. Have any of you seen uh, Morpheus? No. And if I was dreaming, he would be here. Absolutely. He would be main character. We should see if we can find Morpheus. Yeah. Morpheus, I mean, Morpheus, I never remember which one it is. It's a little weird that, I, like, okay, like, Kwame got his mom back, and Lenny, don't listen real quick. Okay. And Lenny got his brother back, and you and I just kind of, like, had life changes, like, you know. Well, I mean, consider ourselves fortunate that we've never had to experience that level of loss. Let's. That's true. Yeah. They, what they... What they've gained is far bigger and more important than suddenly being friends with the school president or being a president of a club. Uh, oh, Kim, Kim's been through a fairly significant change as well. Thank so, you for acknowledging it, Manny. So, I mean, I bet you look great as an adult, though. I'm really interested in seeing what your style is. But, Manny, if I'm the president, I can't be cast in anything. <laughs> Manny, I don't uh, like this anymore. Manny, tell me that this is the thing, back. though. You maybe can't be the cast anymore, but you can no. tell everyone what to no, do. No, I don't want. I want to be the star. No, Manny. Well, maybe you. Oh, that's I want to know what suck. It would suck as if you if you had gotten the main main role and. Oh, it's just you and hello, <laughs> hello, and Lenny's Manny, not listening. Hello? Oh, hi, Lenny. <laughs> okay. Uh, Dahlia, Dahlia had has had a is having a nervous breakdown, so uh -huh. I'm gonna go ahead and get dressed and wait for her to show up, uh, at it at my at my my dorm room, um, with plenty of chocolate for her. Um, well, if she'll eat it, she might complain about what it'll do to her vocal cords. But anyways, uh, I'll see you in a few minutes. Yeah, no problem. All right, bye. Oh boy. Um, Manny, as you put your phone away. Uh, you look out from the Galana dorms. You're on the fifth floor, so you have a really good view of most of the school campus. <coughs> the old auditorium, the old uh, building where you saved Nanako that time and you found your divinities and Morpheus was using as kind of like a doorway when he was dealing with the Phantom Queen. That's gone. No. Oh. I must have torn down the old auditorium. That's okay. I need a little bit of clarity. Maat, care to explain what the frick frack is going on around here? Hello? Maat appears before you, but instead oh. of gold, they are kind of ruby colored. Hmm. This is a new look. Crisis. Cr crisis? Crisis. Maat, are you okay? 
crisis. Yeah, I'm getting that. I'm getting that this is a crisis. Are you, is the red, to, like a red alert? Are you trying to like speak nerd talk to me? I mean, that's fine. I get it. All right. Um, we're going to have the first roll of the session and first roll of the season. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and teach everyone real quick how to play uh, overarms. So Manny, I'm going to ask you to roll a stat, which I believe you are pretty good at. I'll see. We're gonna have you roll. Do 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 do. Uh, charisma. A oh, charisma, just a charisma roll. All right. Just charisma because you are not using my op right now. Cool. All right. And I'm going go. to ask for a four or better. <laughs> I love it. I rolled a one. Amazing. Perfect. Do we have um, rerolls? Are we doing rerolls? I don't remember uh, if we're doing we, them or not. Uh, it doesn't matter doing? if we're not. I, it's fine. I just wanted to know. I think we one has the first. We don't have. I, I think one in this circumstance is perfect. My dice understood the assignment. <laughs> um. Hey, look on the bright side. We'll go up from here. Um. Maat begins blaring like a siren. Oh. Oh. And your vision, you tend to highlight things when you're trying to find the truth and trying to find lies. Everything is glowing. Everything is glowing, then not glowing, and glowing again. And it's kind of like a shrove is going off directly into your retinas. Oh. And it's loud and disorienting. Oh. And I'm going to go ahead and say you have disoriented four. Ow. So if you roll under a four, I one of your dice drops for uh -huh. the session. Okay. Oh, shh. Maat, quiet, please. Quiet, please. Ow, that is painful, and I don't like it at all. Please, please stop. I, uh, you dismiss her, and just in the back of your head, you hear manic muttering. <laughs> Oh, I don't like that. Oh, I've never seen her like that before. That is okay. No. Um, and Manny just sends a quick text. Hey guys, you should hurry. Um, and they sort of like change into like closer to real, uh, closer to real clothes, like not their uniform. Uh, I think they've decided they're going to take a mental health day. Um, so just casual clothes. Yeah, it doesn't take long for everyone to arrive at your dorm. Kwame, you have a car now, so that's fun. Um, and uh, I want it noted that um, when Kwame left, he just went out the door, didn't say hi to anybody, just left. But he did before. I mean, obviously, Anansi, you, those papers, come with me. Um, and yeah. He skitters behind you with a fat stack of notes. And some red string because we're good. It's getting to that point. Yep, yep, yep. Yep. I will drive and I will get there. Um, does Lenny need to be picked up? No, Lenny, you're not. You are still on campus. You're just in, uh, well, kind of the teacher's apartment complex. Cool. Then I will meet them at, meet at Manny's, you said? Meeting at Manny's. Cool. Yep. I will drive, get to the parking lot, go there, make sure nothing's changed. I mean, it's probably a lot of change. Don't want to know. And then just book it. <laughs> yeah. So um, the four of you are in Manny's uh, dorm room, uh, joined by Kim, who is writing up excuses on a little notepad she has because, well, she says it herself. If I'm going to have 10 years of my 20 years of my life now stolen, I might as well enjoy the benefits. And she just hands out, you know, hall passes that give you a day off for, you know, no problem. You look like a, you look great as an adult, Kim. I'm I'm loving the or I guess should I call you Miss uh Miss Winters Ash? Don't you No. Now the question is, is that Ash did you and Dr. Ash get married? I think I thought, he adopted me. I thought adopted. Okay. Yeah. All right. I was hoping that was still the case because now that you're like 
no, your actual no. age. Because even if I did age, like I should have aged before I died. There is still an inappropriate age difference between you and Dr. Ash. He's, old, he's yeah. been old enough. He, he, he's an old guy, okay? And I don't even swing. I way. take it back. The whole the whole thought process was flawed. <laughs> there, now, there's a lot of flaws like a here, mentor from Manny. the beginning for her. So that was well, no, I don't want to. I, I didn't want to insinuate that it was anything. But also, I was just trying English to get the Oh, Can well, I call you, know. you Teach? Ooh, oh, that's good. I will punch you square in the You're nuts. not allowed to do that because you are now an adult. Yeah, and you, you are yes. a minor. You can't, you can't like, so hit you a kid. I know us. that. Oh, this is terrible. <laughs> so, well, kid can't hit me anymore. Is Kwame, ah. Kwame's here, yeah? Yeah. Hi, Kwame. So, Kwame, uh, I, was, I was just wondering, um, why am I the president and not, like, the star of every single... You know? Also, I think before know. before we do that, do either of you need and or want a hug? I mean, sure. Oh. I always like hugs. Manny gives Lenny <laughs> a big, 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 big hug. Uh, yeah, yeah. M Manny, Manny, Kwame, uh, he will not, not that he needs a hug, but he will accept a hug. Manny gives him big, big hug, too. Just big, 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 big hugs. <sighs> Um, I can't uh, unfortunately offer you a hug, Miss Winters Ash. I'm fine. Okay, this is fine. I'm fine. I don't know why I was so oh, upset earlier. Yeah. This is fine. You want a hug? Fine. Yes, I want a hug. I'm also closer to thirty. <laughs> God, I voted. Who did I vote for? Who am I kidding? I know who I voted for. Um. In response to your question, uh, Dahlia, uh, I I don't think this was me. And I say think because there's a lot that obviously has changed. Last we remember, or at least I remember, it was like September or October, and now it's not September or October. So there's a lot of time that has happened, and I don't remember any of it. Yeah, um, it's February, you all. In case you didn't know, it is currently February. But if it wasn't you, then it, it was someone who knew, like, us. Because these are all changes that, you know. Well, like, there's, I mean, I don't know. There's a lot that it could have been. There's a lot that um, could have happened and not necessarily be based on us um yeah because if if i like understand it you have like changed moments or whatever and it's like you know it's had ripple through you know your life and others but like this is like the amount of like paracausal energy that like people whoever did this uh the, this wasn't one event this is like heckin 15 20 events in our lives this is big time stuff. Not that Onansi isn't big time stuff, but like this is whew, big I mean, time stuff. And like you've told us that this sort of stuff can have consequences, but so far I'm not seeing any consequences except for the fact that we are all very much not sure what the heck is going on. I mean, I've definitely lost like, you know, a significant amount of muscle mass. I think I haven't been working out. Are you on the football team? I I don't know. I mentioned hey. football, but Quentin didn't say anything about it. I am not on the basketball team either, nor am I the captain of the basketball team. That did not happen. I'm apparently really good friends with the school president. She brought coffee, told me about a meeting. I think I might be on the school council. Oh, I used to be on the school council. Am I sitting on the... Maybe we should figure out how much has changed and whether or not there is anybody at the school who might you, know why. I, I look directly at Anansi. Let me see those papers. He hands them over. Wait. Is Dr. Ash, like, you know... Still the... Yeah, like here? 
they still like are, are I'm gonna like Lenny just gets out and he just Googles Dr. Ash. I'm sure it's not hard, like looking for anything obvious like <laughs> an obituary from ninety five or something like whatever, you know. Uh you look him up, Dr. Ash. Um he is not the dean of the school anymore, but he is the founder of the school. Oh. Uh, he is currently doing uh, research in uh, South Africa. So, wherever the dean is, that's going to be a question. But mm -hmm. uh, wonder if it's Doctor Wang. I don't know. I'll. No. That was my next thought process. Yeah, because they disagreed a lot on like the nature of like power or whatever. Dr. Wang's um, divinity was... I don't remember. I don't have it written down. I, I just knew that she had the ability to like revert divinities like I did, but I don't know if I ever got her... her yeah, Dr. Divinity. Wang uh, has a very particular divinity uh, whose name is somewhere in my notes. I'm like, I don't remember. Okay. Yeah. Um, uh, either way, I'm gonna like like sit on the ground and just start like looking at the notes, and I'm gonna try to look at the first store, first page, if I can figure out which one is the first page, just to see what Anansi started to write. Yeah. Well, whatever change it happened, it changed at least ten years. I don't know if it goes back further. It, no, it definitely goes back further. It goes back twenty years. So I I kind of want to propose something that might well I actually want to ask a question how much do we want to know about how much has changed do we want to try to change things back should we go through a day in our new shoes and figure out exactly what's going on like this is oh i should tell you all what happened with maat and Manny tells them what happens, what happened with Maat. So she wasn't a much help other than the fact that there is apparently a major crisis going on. And it sound, and then sounded the alarm and was very loud and very disturbing. Maat is broken. Something is wrong. Very, very, very wrong. To the point that she considers it to be a crisis. And... I know, like you know, you you know, like you, you, the president now, and and Dahlia has some form of success, whatever. But I I don't know how, if my mother is back. I want to know why she's back. Once I know why, I can figure out what happened, or I can figure out what I'm going to do. But I can't sit here and just act like I wasn't the reason she died. And now she's here. I mean, the funny thing is that we still all ended up with our divinities. So, I mean, that in and of itself is consistent, but my divinity isn't working properly. Have you tried to access Persephone yet, Dahlia? Mm, no. Um, no. Sure. I'm right here. I haven't gone anywhere, I promise. She's still she's still with me. That's good. Is she okay? I'm gonna bring her out. Uh she appears in front of you. Um a forest midnight color woman surrounded by uh dead leaves and vegetation, and she looks like you have always seen her. Do you feel any different? Something is missing from me. Not physically, not magically, but in my heart, something's no. missing. Is he here? Do we know if he's here? Because if he's not here, that means Hades isn't here either. I can't. No. You have his number. You should try and call him. We should try to call all of the other god kids to that see was if they're my, here. That was my thought because Kim remembers. 
So any Kim, of the Kim, God you, touched should. Yeah, Kim, have you tried to to access the Phantom Queen? Uh, next in the middle of your dorm room, Manny, which is getting a little crowded, uh, appears a vortex of black feathers and onyx. All right, cool. She's still intact. I wonder if she was ever actually the Phantom Queen if you didn't die. The gym is missing. I mean, the old auditorium, it's gone. I'm going to um, send a quick text to Nick just to make sure that he and um, his I'm gonna daughter hit up, are fine. Yeah, I'm going to hit up Helen. Um, Helen, you're able to get a hold of. You have her number. Uh, Kwame, you don't have Nick's number. Don't take away my child from me. Oh, oh that's oh, no. um Kim, you are faculty now. Can you look up Nick? I'll do you one better. She walks into the vortex of black feathers. And she's gone. Okay, bye. <laughs> um, and then Manny, you get a text message and it's a photo. Actually, it's not a photo. You get a text message saying, look outside. I look outside? You see uh, Kim standing literally where the old auditorium used to be. Fuck yeah! <laughs> I don't know how that was supposed to help us um, figure out what's going on with Nick. But she texts okay. you back. She texts you real quick. Yeah, sorry, that was just for me. I'm on my way to go uh, look up Nick. Cool. Um, Helen, <laughs> but Helen gets back to me. Uh, I also hit up um, our, our friend from the UK as well to make sure he's uh, all right. Yeah, you're able to get a hold of him. Uh, yes, it's Divinity. And I also hit up, um, uh, why am I forgetting her name? Uh, um, Kelly's character. Oh. Yeah. I had Iris. Her. Iris, thank Iris. you. I knew it started with an I when I was like Iris. No. Iris. Um, but I hit Iris. I hit up all of the old crew. Uh, um, the old guard. Yeah. You get a lot of text messages back from Iris. Uh mostly wondering if you're a phishing scam or something for a moment, which uh. isn't out of character. This something is entirely what you expect. It's deeply, yeah. it's deeply comforting the moment it happens. It's like, oh iris but now i'm realizing it's possible that iris and i never became friends never became friends yep is iris in france she's in france and uh, after you you know uh pass the captcha thing she sends you she's like hi manny doing great okay cool. smiley face all right she's just she writes out smiley face she's slightly still slightly she's a little bit more paranoid than last time we spoke so cool right okay cool 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 great so i i report that like it looks like all of our our oh and uh zoya don't don't want to forget zoya how's our um, how is our how's our circus group doing the circus group is currently uh doing the clown invitationals in new jersey but uh she's fine i'm glad it's in new jersey because kwame probably would not be okay with that anyways um, <laughs> good um uh, uh while, while this is happening i still want to just see what that first page of a uh, nancy's notes were or nancy's story was okay i was birthed in light okay jesus once that was settled what light was settled we continue to create. Eventually, I argued. The argument grew, and so resentment was born. Mm. After resentment was born, eventually power was born, and then envy. From envy came the idea of perhaps others being in charge. Mm, hold on, hold on. Resentment came envy. Okay. Okay. Uh, now, Kwame, uh, do you read Japanese? 
I can leave it to a roll, but I he definitely Let's was give one. It an intelligence roll, and I'm looking for an eight. Yeah, he definitely was the one who knew a lot of our languages, or knew, or like at least tried to learn a lot of languages. Nine. Ah! Mm. The story changes from first person to third person, um, and it is an excerpt from the Book of Genesis, uh, King James version. Come on, the only one. Okay, anyway. I, that's kind of the only one I know. I'm yeah. Jewish, but you want. Um, <laughs> Listen, every version that's not the Hebrew version is mistranslated anyway, so it doesn't matter. Right. Mm. Yeah, the Hebrew one sometimes. Um, it kind of drones on and on and eventually changes uh, to Korean. Give me another intelligence roll. Looking for an eight again. That's so mean. And Nazi doesn't speak these languages. No, one. Yeah, no, no. See, you, you, you watch your uh, you watch your Sentai. You're not watching the K dramas, and that's where you messed up here. Wow, because that has something to do with basic literacy of other languages. Um, but as you thumb through it, eventually you find the French, which I know you speak. Um, this one is a child's story of how babies are made. And eventually you fi find one. Uh, this one is in English, and it is a very curt story about uh, the very first possession on American soil by a colonist, of course. Um, give me an intelligence roll. See if you speak Navajo. Mm -hmm. I guess it's seven. It was close. Nope. Uh -huh. The languages keep shifting and the stories are all jumbled. None of it makes any sense. But they all are the beginnings of things, is what I'm catching on. They're to. all beginnings of stories. Yeah. They're all creation stories. Exactly. They're all creation stories, which make which is what I was trying to get to. And he just says, Oh, okay. Um, after we figure out Nick's fine, I do think we need to speak with Dr. Um, Mrs. You didn't Dr. Get a hold of Nick. I know. Kim was going to get a hold of Nick. Ah, uh, that's true. Yeah. Um, um, either way, uh, go see Dr. Mrs. Wang, whatever her title is now. See if she knows anything. Um, but from these stories that Anansi is saying, it's all about creation, um, about the beginnings of things. Whoever was at the beginning of, of it all, specifically what threw me off was, and I look at Anansi, once light was settled, we continue to create. Who are we? Um, Nazi is not looking at you. He has found um, a notebook of Manny's and is still writing. Um, this time in Portuguese. Hey, friend. <laughs> what? Stop writing for two seconds. Don't sorry, count. I'm having a bit of a day. I, I can see that. Who? Oh, Manny, I apologize. Here's your, here's your notebook. Who... Are the fellow creation gods or entities that you spoke about? I don't know. You have Pangu, who uh, turned into a TV head, still trying to figure that one out. You got uh, Yahweh, and that's for the, you know... Uh, uh huh. Judeo Christian, the, the, yep. The Christians. Uh, you got me, not, not really, not really that, but kind of. Uh, you got Shango, he was uh, more that. Uh, you got uh, Susano O. There's a lot. So, not a help. Got it. Um, I am trying to figure it out. Give me a break. I am one spider. God. You have eight legs. Good point. Each leg can do something else. That's all. I'm not rushing you. I'm just saying you can do more than you think you can. Oh, um, okay. Mm. So it's my fault. It's my fault. I did not say it was your fault. No, no, I understand. I understand. Clearly, you're putting the blame on me. It's I fine. did not put the blame on you. If anything, I would be thanking you for giving my mother back. That's not the point right now. The point is just trying to see if all of this information can come together. That's it. Well, I don't mean to, like, you know, drive conversation, but, like, it seems like if the auditorium's not there and, like, the door to oblivion's not there. And Kim's 
alive and never died, then at no point was she killed. Then at no point did the did her divinity turn and try and bring her back and open a door to oblivion. And the last thing I remember was us fighting the door to like oblivion. Um so some sort of mass hallucination or I think it, did I destroying think the, the door to oblivion reset time. I think maybe that either we did something that reset things or whatever's on that other side did something to us. Cause clearly, I mean, Maat's not like, you know, tip top shape or whatever. She's doing um, real bad. I don't think, honestly, I don't think any of us are in like the best mental capacity right now. So, I mean, this, I, as cool as some of the stuff is, it does it kind of, kind of feels like an attack. Have you gotten a hold of your boyfriend yet, Dahlia? Um, well... <clears throat> no, I'm on my, like, 15th revision of this text. Like, what if we're not dating in this, this, you know? Like, what if we've never been on a date? What if he doesn't know who I am? What if he thinks I'm weird? What if he's like, just, oh, she's too high say, class for me. She's the president. I'm a text saying, hi, this is Dahlia. How are you? I mean, just even... But then what if we have been dating and I say, hi, this is Dahlia. And then he's like, yeah, I know it's Dahlia. Well, it's fine. It's a lot he's, of probably, he's probably going to completely understand if he is here and he's probably going through the same thing we all are. So. Okay. Yeah, you're right. Um... Oh, thanks, Kwame. Oh. So it looks like Kwame already is. No, uh, I haven't yet, but I'm like, <laughs> you have until I'm done texting this out to send that okay. message, or I'm sending one. All right, I got, I got, I'm going to do a voice memo. <clears throat> Hi, babe. Good morning. Hope you're having a great day. Would you mind meeting me at Manny's? We're having a surprise party. Okay, I sent it. That was stupid. Oh, that was not good. No, Anansi we're... looks up from his pens. Yeah, no, that was that was terrible. No, no, let's build each other up and not tear each other down. It's fine. Well, like, I already have the I already have the <laughs> scorecard. It's a one. No, come on. This is a rough enough day without us being hard on ourselves. Okay. Me? Is it marked as delivered? Ooh, yeah, I am a member of yeah. the Go Council. It's marked as delivered, and then it's marked as listened. And there's no response. They must be busy eating breakfast. <laughs> or maybe it's just like intimidated because like you're like so cool all the time. Yeah, it could be that. It could be that. So I'm cool in this universe? I mean, I mean you're, you're always cool. Yeah. Honestly, you, you've always been like a fountain of just such raw charismatic energy that it's like sometimes it's like it's like a lot. You're like, wow, I can't believe like. I'm standing next to like a celebrity. Yeah, you've got that energy. So eventually you do get a response. Oh, okay. it is a text message. Uh, it looks a little Google translated. Oh. Who is this? It's three in the morning. Oh, oh um, no. He must be visiting family. Oh, in, oh, in France. Yeah. Oh, is he in France right now? What if he's visiting Iris? Wait, hold on just a second. Iris, so I reached out to Iris and Iris answered me back. Is Iris still here? Maybe Iris never went to France. And if Iris never went to France, maybe he never came here. Uh um. Spiro wasn't a foreign exchange student. He was just. He wasn't, student. but even so. Yeah. He. Maybe it's he, equivalent. He wanted exchange. to go back to France, but then he told his parents no, that he was going to stay here. It sounds like that's not the story written for this current time. Or maybe you two broke up. But or maybe also, you never knew each other. He's not this bad at English usually. Like, this is just saying, hey, I don't know who you are. Just a joke, I guess. 
Tell him you're Dahlia. Let me send him a picture. Okay. Mm, Lenny, you're being super quiet over there. Are you okay? Uh, yeah. Um, it's just like, I don't know how to feel. Um, yeah. it's, it's, it's weird. Um, cause like, I'm not saying like, I loved everything that was happening in like my life for this, but it was like mine, you know, I know I made choices and decisions, uh, that I had to live with. Uh, but now like, I don't know. Now I'm living someone else's life who looks just like me and, um, some things are better, but it's not mine. Hey, do you all want to stay the night tonight? I know it's still early in the morning, but if you guys want to like crash here instead of like going back home today, yeah, like that's totally cool with me. Yeah, because I think like if I go back to my apartment, I might like completely break down. So I think that'd be good. Okay. Yeah, you definitely can hang out with me. Um, Dahlia, you get response. Um, you're quite pretty, but uh, who are you? He, he called me pretty. Yeah, he okay. Doesn't know who I am. Oh, maybe he doesn't have a divinity then, because that would explain why Persephone feels like something's missing. No, I don't think that's it. Is it just that? Is because the spear is not here? I just think the story is different right now. Hades and Persephone can still be together and just be separate. She didn't say that it was Hades that was missing. She just said something was. Yeah. Is, some, is something missing from you, Anansi? Stop writing. Wait. Um, Persephone, come back out. Uh, Persephone appears. I'm going to take a picture of Persephone and send it to Spiro. I remember her. Who? Oh. I don't think he has Hades. But um, oh, right side, um, he thinks I'm pretty. Um. Yeah, but he's also not here, and Hades isn't here, and Persephone is feeling the effects of that. How Man, about rings. Oh. Manny? Huh? I'm sorry. One more time. Your phone rang. It's My ringing. phone rang. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, I realized I was talking over. I was like, hey. yeah, I, I, I missed. I missed the. All right. Uh, Manny answers it. Hello. Yeah. Hi. It's uh, Miss Winters Ash. No, fuck Kim. Call me Kim. I'm not doing that. Um, okay, Miss Winters Ash. I will. I will fight you. Um, you are not allowed to fight a student. I don't care. You should. It's your life. I got this job this morning. I don't care if I lose it. What am I saying? Look, I found Nick. He, um, one, still not much of a talker. Two, no idea who I am. Three, couldn't see, uh, couldn't see uh, anything. Oh, also doesn't have a divinity. Got it. Okay, yeah. so this isn't affecting everyone the same way. Interesting. All right, thanks, Miss Winters. Ash, we'll see you again. Actually, you probably shouldn't be meeting students in their dorm rooms for the time being. I'm not I'll... meeting here in a dorm room. I'm in a class right now. Okay. That's why I'm not cussing you out. Okay. Can you ask Kim a super important question? Uh... Miss Kim, uh, Miss Winters, Ash. Yes. Has a question for you. <laughs> does. Uh, when you teach, are you one of those teachers that like sits on a desk or in a backwards chair so that you can relate? Let me. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye. Beep. I think we just need to go find, at least hopefully, Doctor Wang. Let's get some information from someone who might might know more. If we can find. Dr. Wang. Well, or we yeah. just go to the dean. Yeah. The dean. Who's the dean? That's the question. We need to go. What are you guys going to do? 
go see if we can figure out who the heck the dean is, I guess. Yeah, let's go to the dean's office. Yeah, I mean, my schedule is free. No more dates in my future, so. Oh, Dahlia, do you want to No, it's hug? okay. I need and... to focus on my career as the president anyway. Do you want to hug? Yeah. Nanny gives Dahlia a big, big hug, too. Thanks. It's going to be okay, everyone. We're going to figure this out. As Manny, as Manny's talking to Dahlia, Kwame's going to go over to Lenny and just kind of like bump his shoulder or like bump his arm. Hey. Oh. Uh, hey. I'm not going to ask you how are you feeling because huh. that's. Yeah. My head is full of ants right now. <laughs> um. Yeah. 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 That's 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 very appropriate. Um, not often that someone dies and comes back. Although it happens like, you know, more regularly these days. So like I'm trying to like take it in stride. You know, you actually might be stronger than me in that front. I couldn't look at my mother, so uh I'm just kind of pretending it didn't happen. I mean, this is not the first time um someone has shown me m my brother uh or tried to rewrite the events of my life. So, you know, um I'm worried this one's going to stick, and I don't know how to feel about it. Uh, luckily, that's something we can um, figure out a little later. But at least try to at least figure out what the hell's going on first before we make those decisions. Hey, can I just say something really fast, Dahlia? We're going to get through this. One, two... I'm really glad that if I have to go through something this ridiculous with anyone, I get to do it with the safety squad. Yeah, with all of us from the safety squad. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, I feel and like we're awesome. We can we can figure this out. We can fix it. Yeah, like me from like a year ago wouldn't know what to do, but like I feel like I I'm a lot stronger now. I mean, not physically, obviously. Look, I mean, look at me. I'm, you I'm, are shut up. You are very. You look great. I you you I'm gonna, I'm 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 gonna do the Peggy Carter touch the peck of Ca of Steve uh, of Captain America. Yeah, thing. none like, of you, you are, can tell you that he's lost fine. muscle mass, but he definitely feels it. <laughs> <laughs> so he looks exactly the same. He just keeps talking about it. <laughs> like, shush. Uh, as we start leaving, I'm gonna like lean into Manny and be like. Hey, did you notice in this universe, Kwame doesn't say he's not in the safety squad? That means no, he, is. he just, he makes the funny faces still, but I think we're starting to wear it. It's progress. It is progress. And like, like Manny just kind of holds out a fist for Dahlia to bump. And yeah. Behind you see him. Best friends his forever. Dahlia and his Manny. Head. <laughs> He's out. It's been a day. Pick your battles, you know. Yeah, <laughs> well, there are, the, the, there the battles are picked right now. The battles are picked. Know. That is one of them. <laughs> so, um, where are you going, Doc? You know where the uh, dean's office is. It's probably where Doctor Ashes used to be. Yeah. Um, and it's not hard to find Doctor Wang. She's either in class or, well, now you know where the teachers probably live around here if they live on campus so should we start with dr wang or start with the dean i mean who knows they might be one and the same let's start with the uh, dean. that's what i'm thinking too it might not be but i suppose my thought what if All we right. have some weird evil dean then we fix that cool. yeah like what if it's like loki or something so, oh if it's loki I mean, that would be awesome it's not like it's. it would be the first time we've kicked the dean's ass. It wouldn't. <gasps> this is true. But also, Loki, that would be awesome. Kwame just pauses. Loki is also one who can change reality. <gasps> oh, what if it's Loki? Ooh. All right, let's go. It doesn't take you guys long to get to the dean's office. Located in the clock tower that overlooks North Point Academy. Um, what are you putting on? Shush. 
Shushin. Um, located in the clock tower that overlooks North Point Academy and also has a beautiful view of the vista all the way down to the beach of North Point, Oregon. Um, you ride the elevator up and you are greeted with a very large and luxurious office, no longer beholden to the research of divinity. Uh, there are no artifacts. There is just mm -hmm. plenty of room and there's books and there's portraits. Standing at the desk is a tall, tall man with broad shoulders, piercing black eyes and uh, red hair. He's in fairly good shape. He's got a bit of a belly, but he's, you know, you know, not bad looking. Definitely in good shape. Um, and he greets you all with a smile. Ah, just the four I've been waiting for. He closes the uh, book in front of him as he stands up. He stretches a little. <clears throat> so, how do you like it? Do we recognize this person? No. You've never seen this man before in your life. How do we like what exactly? My thank you gift. Who are you? Oh, um, listen, I'm one of those many names sorts. Uh, why don't we just call me Ari for the time being? What? Ari? Okay. Yeah. Ari. A-R-I. A-R-I. <laughs> cool. Yeah. Um, by thank you gift, do you mean all of these weird changes? Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, for the sake of... Um, if you're going to be speaking in circles, I'm not in the mood for circles. Oh, I don't do circles, dude. Sorry. You you started by no, not giving us an actual name. All right, fine. I'm the devil. Ari. Ari. Ari, short for... He turns his nameplate around. Ari S. Black. Mm. Ari's Black. Uh-huh. Black goat. Uh-huh. Uh, okay. Why, uh, Mr. Devil, sir, Satan, Please tell me, Mr. Sir, Black. I don't want to do the whole devil thing. Lucifer, Beelzebub, I don't know. There are Beelzebub's a different guy, but. Right, okay. I, not like, I'm Muslim. I don't give a shit. Anyways. Um, why? Why? You let me out. You broke the door. Well, you didn't just break the door. You made sure the door never existed. Like, and you were supposed to die. So you're welcome. Instead, I rewrote it. I rewrote everything. For the gain of what? I'm free. I'm free. I want to find my daughter. I want to eat a pretzel in New York. I don't know. Daughter? Yeah. Pretzel? Oh, they're delicious. Full of carbs. <laughs> carbs, butter, and carbs, fat, and sodium. It's really, honestly, the only thing you need in life. No, but seriously, you have a daughter? Yes, seriously. I have a daughter. Okay. Why did you do this without asking us first why well, did I mean, we it, it, lose time why have so many things changed listen i tried to rewind time as best i could it just kind of landed in february don't worry about it like how the last long, couple months what do you mean rewind i meant to re listen what i wanted to do was reset at the beginning of the year you all you know just start fresh you don't have to deal with it but certain things just kind of Listen, there's certain things I can change and things I can't change. And this was something I, you know, turns out the times are a little wonky. But hey, don't worry about it. You got plenty of time to get used to it. 
Now, what does the big guy think about all this? Sorry, I keep talking and interrupting other people from trying to ask questions. Kwame, go. No, that's a good question because if I remember correctly, I'm not going to like talk down on you, but like in your specific pantheon, you're not the big cheese. So, no, look, who decides what the big cheese is? The people who write it. I, I know one. Yeah, see, the people who write it, and who decides who writes it? People, people, normal people, everyday people who don't have, you know, superpowers and, you know, giant plant women hanging out with them. How you doing, Dahlia? Do you like being president? I thought president was pretty good. I made you, I made you the lead for the last three plays, so that was cool. Yeah. No, I don't Bye like YouTube. being president, and I don't like that you took my beautiful man away from me, and Persephone's husband just hey. took him away. And Afraid then of the competition? you caused trauma to my two friends by making them wake up in these realities where they have to confront people that they thought were dead without any warning. Consent is key here, my guy, and hey, you really hey. fucked this one up big time. Preach. Well, deal with it. I don't think any of us are happy. What do you mean, deal with it, you jerk? Deal with it. I'm not changing it back. Oh. I, don't even know, I don't even know if I know how. Because you're not a creation god. And yet yeah. you started to do things you're not supposed to do. Mm, yeah, people kept kind of building on my story. And it's gotten to the point where, like, watch this, and his head rotates 360. Great. I can just do that now. Where the fuck did that come from, right? <laughs> In any case, you you messed up big time. Yeah. Well? And I think you have a little bit of narcissistic personality disorder because you're just sitting here saying, my story, my story. Oh, it's my story. Oh, I'm the big cheese. I'm tired of this. I mean, that's rich coming from you, but... Or... What did you do to my aunt? Listen, she just needs to get used to it, okay? I altered reality. Everything is currently a lie and the truth at the same time. You messed with my divinity and made her... You're not nice. I mean, I didn't think you were because you're the devil, but you're really not nice. Never claimed to be. You so, mess with things you have no business messing with. So you think that we're supposed to be happy in this reality? Where Mommy's divinity it. can't stop writing, where Manny's divinity is constantly having a breakdown, where my divinity has lost her other half. You think we're all supposed to be happy with this? Yeah. No. Because I gave him his mom back. I gave him his brother back. I made you. Oh, you haven't you even figured out what I gave you. Works? Do you not know how feelings work? They haven't I'm... seen their family members for years. They're going through the grief process, and then suddenly all that. It... Are you kidding me? He blinks at you, and the silence is deafening. I thought Anansi. I was going to say um, that uh, all we are is like our memories. Um, so, like, uh, my brother died when I was six years old. That person may look like my brother uh, and may have my brother's memories, but he had, also has memories that weren't my brother's. So that's not my brother. And I'm not me, because I'm me, but I'm not the, the me that's supposed to be here because I don't have his memories. This is why existentialism was a mistake. Like the ship of Theseus paradox. That's what Lenny was saying. Okay. And here's my rebuttal. What the fuck are you going to do about it? Have you met us? Anansi? Are you mm -hmm. writing right now? I'm trying not to write anymore. Can you quickly give me a history lesson? Sure. When was the beginning of Christianity? About 70 AD? Yeah, that's give or take. Right. Yeah, so I'd give you that. I'd give you that. 
The beginning of West African Gods is a lot older than that, correct? Oh, I could babysit him. I would not threaten things that could... Mm. I mean, my gods are older than yours. Same. The issue isn't that you rewrote reality. The issue is you've created a conundrum that none of us have the time or ability to fix right now. And now you're creating a lot more problems because you are now free. We're not mad that you gave us back these stories. We're mad that you didn't ask us. And now there's a big problem and we have to fix it. Well... I ask again. What are you going to do about it? We're going to kick me, your ass. Let yeah. me spin you a story in which your webs are your wings are clipped. I want to try my best right now to like lock him here, and he can't move. He stands up and he smiles, and we're going to call it here. Oh, Next oh, week, please. we're fighting the devil. I guess my blood please. is boiling. This is. Oh I like playing an asshole. It's fun. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, everybody, that's oh boy. Oh boy, indeed. You fucked with the wrong four people. <laughs> you really did. Apparently. So. And I really everyone... have no idea what Manny's whole boon is, but I don't know if they're. Gonna I don't. I, I I don't even know where the anger is coming from, which is the scariest part. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's something deep in that. I and mean, I, I, he I, fucked with stuff he had no business fucking with. Let's yeah. just be real. Well, there's that old thing about talk shit, get hit. And he certainly talks shit. He's the devil. What else is he going to do? This is true. Anyway, true. my name is Stephen Pope. Thank you for joining us here on New Pantheon Academia. Um, you can find me online uh, elsewhere at The Professional Hobbit. I'm really only on TikTok right now because I realized most social media was bad for my mental health. So kind of stepped away from most of it. Now I'm just kind of on the one that delivers me cats. I appreciate that. Um, apart from that, you can check me out at cityofmist.co slash queers, uh, where you might, I think we're still taking pre-orders on queers, the LGBT Super Sentai role-playing game. Um, we have some amazing people working on it. I'm a lead writer on it, so I'm working my ass off. It is my full-time job right now, and it's, uh, yeah, pretty cool. I actually have a, I have a, a you and I have a common acquaintance uh, on queers that I'll have to talk to you about after we get off stream. Absolutely. Um, let's go and thank you for dealing with our technical difficulties i'm glad my beautiful amazing talented cast could hold it but of course they could hold it while i was dealing with that and lying on the floor in a puddle of my own tears because they're amazing starting with uh critical bard where can they find you my friend oh hi um, <laughs> that's where, I, that's where I'm at. Who I don't, <laughs> you know, like when you go too deep into like someone's psyche, I guess went like way deep into Kwame. I'm like, oh, he needs a drink. Uh, hi, my name is Omega Jones, also known as the Critical Bard for now. Uh, Critical Bard across all social media channels. Uh, I am doing many awesome things. I'm an active workplace well, tabletop professional. I can, you can catch me on Mondays tomorrow. Hey, for the second episode of Tides of Wild Mount with a Realmsmith. Uh, you can catch me uh, on other things. Uh, I can't think of them right now. Uh, and then next week, I am, well, this week coming up, I am one of the uh, Fanimation Week ambassadors with Fanology and Amazon Prime Video, where uh, for me, Tuesday through Saturday, I will be doing watch parties of different adult animation on Amazon Prime. Uh, and then oh, something yeah. else is happening the next week that I can't talk about just yet. But, you know, if you put Amazon and animation together, and a premiere of something is happening, then, you know, we'll, we'll, I won't say what, but I will let you infer. What on earth could it be? Who knows? Um, what on earth could it be? Mm-hmm. What on I didn't even know this was that until I bought it, but it's fine. <laughs> uh, yeah, other than that, catch me on my socials for all the things that I'm doing. Uh, I think that's really it. Goodbye. All right, throwing it over to R.I.P. Mika. Hello, I'm R.I.P. Mika. Um, I'm a variety streamer on Twitch. You can find me on Twitch, um, I recently I've been taking a hiatus just to figure out what I want to do in life. <laughs> I'm having like a midlife crisis at this point. <laughs> Same. Um, 
I think That's after two year years of it. like after two years of this, a lot of people yeah. are taking an opportunity to figure out what it, the heck it is they actually be want to be doing with their time. And you are yeah. valid, my friend. Yeah. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, I'll, I'll see you guys every week on this show. But outside of that, I don't have like a planned schedule because I'm figuring some shit out, you know? Uh, next up, Mix, Genie in a Bottle, Aki. Sup, everybody. I'm Aki. You can find me on Twitter at Mix Genie in a Bottle. That's M X G I N I I N A B O T T L E. Uh, my entire streaming schedule can be found on my Twitch channel. That's twitch.tv slash Shidari Aki. That's S H I I D A R E A K I. Uh, you can tell it's been a while since I've had to do either of those. Um, but yeah, uh, I have a couple of things that are coming down the pipeline that I can't, uh, that I like, will, I will be able to announce soon, but uh, check out the cool things that are going to be happening. Uh, you can find me, gosh, uh, I don't have a lot going on my schedule right now here. Uh, you can catch me with CB when we make our eventual return to Let's Get Wild Mount. Um, there'll be more information about that when that becomes, uh, available and yeah. And cool. last, but certainly not least the Fisher King himself, mostly Eric. Hello. Uh, you can always uh, find me on all the social medias, mostly Eric on all the things. Uh, and, uh, just after this at seven 30 in like an hour and a half, I'm going to be on, uh, uh, playing some board games on twitch.tv slash BNB tabletop. Uh, that's for the board and barrel. That's that's our show. Oh, yeah, very fun. Um, and hey, if catch up on all saving throw shows on YouTube or as podcasts, we do mo almost everything the podcast as well. Uh, remember to like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell, do all the jazz to feed the algorithm, and you'll know when new content is posted. And it really does help us. Uh, join the Exploration Society on Kofi, Kofi or Coffee. I know Whichever. we had this conversation earlier, but Whichever. it's coffee. Coffee. It, you either way, coffee. either way, join us on the Exploration Society. We have a private Discord. We talk shop, including a thread just for this episode. We got a Princess Bride watch along coming soon, and it's where I got my name as a, a professional Hobbit. You can. I'm in an adventure we published. It's very fun. So uh, we'll see you next time. Thank you all for tuning in. And I really hope 2022 is a good year for you as for all of us. Just throwing that out there. Positive vibes and all that shit. Until then, catch you later. Bye.